One of the three straight Conference USA uh, games. The Tech Bulldogs are off this week on their South Florida swing. Two important ball games for Louisiana Tech with the next four to follow at home. As our Kristen Merchant tells us tonight, these next six will define their season. Earlier this month, the Bulldogs offense could barely turn on the ignition, only averaging 65 points as they started league play one and five. Now they're flooring it. Winners of three straight, including dominating Southern Miss, where they shot 70% in the first half, hitting 11 of their season-high 14 threes. The thing you want to do is use performances like that to build confidence, to let yourself and your teammates know that we're capable of playing really good offensive basketball. And again, I thought so much of that occurred because of the efforts that we had defensively against a good Southern Miss team that can really score the ball. Perhaps another sign of improvement? Tech, who's been consistent and coughed up the basketball, only gave it up nine times to the Golden Eagles, a squad who's leading CUSA in turnover margin. It's something that we had talked about every single day, and then even before the game, during the game. you got to give our, our entire team a lot of credit for the decisions that they made, both in the backcourt and in the front court, and finding each other and still getting 21 assists. All right, up next for the Bulldogs, that dreaded Florida trip where they face FAU and FIU. Now, both squads aren't necessarily the best offensively, but defensively, they're both in the top 10 in that category. They're very big, number one. They, they start a team of... 6'5", 6'4", 6'7", 6'10", 7 feet. They do it with really plugging the gaps and in the lane. We've got to really move them. Uh, we've got to get them chasing us. We want to be able to play in, in space and in tempo and uh, be able to get some good shots in the open court. Chris Demersion, NBC 10 Sports.